Don't you dare give up. Don't you dare give in. Okay, that's what I heard this morning because when I woke up, I was just sad. Like, I was like, well, that's how I feel. Like, I know I'm the love of your life. I know God has put us together. But while all this foolishness going on around us, so it was like it, the the dream literally went from like, yay, to like demons. Like, what? Okay, and then also being triggered by Stephanie's video because like I said, I've already gone through that. And so I, I really want to encourage somebody because I had said that the other day in the video, for some of us, we might not have known until after all the crazy stuff happened. For some people, you might have had like a, like a little knowing. Like for me, I didn't watch prophetic words back then. I was young. Um, I didn't really understand warfare. I didn't really understand none of that. I felt felt off, felt weird, but I didn't know what it was, right? And and that was one of my biggest regrets, not fighting back then for letting somebody snake in, move in on my position, but most importantly, me moving from my position. Can somebody take your position if you're sitting in it? The devil had convinced me to not be sitting in it. So I need y'all to understand that that's what he's trying to do. When he make you mad at him, when he make you feel like it's not worth it, the stuff you're going through not worth it, he wants you to abort your promise yourself. And I did that already. Thank God for second chances. But I know what that feels like. So I, I couldn't even watch that any video because I knew it was going to speak to what happened to me years ago. But it was like, dang, like the counterfeit really tried to replace me. And I just let her. Like, how? How did I give up so easily? I'm not doing that again. I am not doing that again. Okay? So don't give up. That's what he told me this morning, even feeling so defeated. Because I run off when I feel uh, hopeless and defeated. Like, it ain't no point. That's when I run off. That's why I ran off back then. I wish I had never did that. I should have prayed. Like, I should have talked to him, told him how I felt. I did not do that. I just ran off. And I regret that. So don't be that person. I woke up the other morning. I heard I'm in love and it's a battlefield. And I was like, that is not a song. He had gave it to me a different melody and everything. I was like, oh, maybe it's my song, you know? And um, it made me go play Jordan Sparks, though. And the part he been highlighting to me the last two mornings, like every time I wake up is, you better go and get your mama, get your mama, get your mama. Okay, it's time to fight. It's time to fight in prayer um, I heard petition, whether that's petition in the throne, which is what the sister in Christ told me this morning. So I'll take that as further confirmation, right? But also opening your mouth to speak to your king and spouse. The devil be telling me all the time I'm bothering him though, and he reassured me all the time that I'm not. And I still feel like I'm bothering him. The devil be trying to make me feel like I'm doing the most, right? Or he don't care to talk to me, all that. I, and at this point, I don't care if that really is the case. Because the demons are going to listen, right? Now, I got to get the cosign from um, God. But I'm this is tired. Like, I'm tired of doing this by myself. I'm tired of feeling like I'm the only person who know who see. And then that's dumb because he be asking me, what do you know? What do you see? And I don't tell him. It's I've I been getting sick, okay, since yesterday. That's how I knew, like, we must be having some type of breakthrough on his end because why am I getting sick? My throat specifically, okay? Like, it ain't like my stomach hurt and I'm just tired. Like, why are you messing with my voice? That And God had been telling me, like, the, the anointing is in your words. It's going to break things off of y'all. And that's why the devil keep fighting me to not talk to him, to not tell him the truth, okay? So, you may be experiencing warfare right now. Sometimes I take that as a sign, right? That's a good sign. Um, get your armor. It's time to fight and don't give up. Cause I was already that girl. I already gave it up once without a fight. I am not doing that again. I don't care if all the hell got to see me. I'm not giving up. Okay. I, even when I get on here and I'm venting and I'm feeling away, I am, I am not giving up because if I got to see all the hell, that's fine. Because the other day when I woke up, God said, you got all the heaven behind you. Bring it. Like, Bring it. I'm ready to fight. You better go and get your armor. Let's go. Like, do not give up and don't give in. That's the important part. Do not give in. Like, I'm going to just take this L. That's what I did, and I regretted it. Do not take this L because the W is promised to you. I'm try I, I only got one hand. I was trying to do this one and this one. The win is promised to you. You are victorious. It's game time. Like, and I know we say that a lot. We've been saying that a lot. But, like, I mean it now. Like, we got to know when we're ready. We got to know when we really want it, when we really want to fight for it, when we know we're ready to fight. I'm ready to fight.
better go and get your armor and that's the difference i'm not finna be doing this by myself i'm finna fight with him remember i said the fight finna be different that's the word that's coming to pass right now the fight is about to be different but your mouth talk to them and fight together okay okay now that's that's for everybody when you like me we right here like we're going through the same in your life y'all communicate y'all have words y'all exchange words y'all have conversations y'all talk about this already even if y'all really understand what's open your mouth start praying together i know when we pray together is different i know when he pray over me is different he's anointed to pray over me right i'm anointed to pray over him imagine i'm hearing the power of three imagine locking hands praying in agreement with the holy spirit in the midst of y'all coming against these things i'm done fighting by myself okay so i hope this gets somebody fired up who need to get fired up okay all right.